guys, Bizer here. Time to find out what's cooking on episode 6 of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Egglock Challenge. Last time we got our first gym badge. Exciting, defeated Roxanne, battled Team Aqua some more, kicked that dummy grunt's butt, got the demon parts back, we met Steven Stone's father, he asked us on a very important journey to go and see his son in due for time, and now we're here to enlist the help of Mr. Briny. So let us go and see him. Mr. Briny, hello. Oh, hello there, lass. Blay that, Pico. Oh, if it ain't Bizer, you're the one who saved my Pico. Ah, but we owe you for that day. What's that? You want to sail with me? What's this all about, then? Ah, letter bound for Dewford. Certainly, that'd be no problem at all. You've come to the right man. Shall we host sail for Dewford once? Yes, we shall. Head to Dewford. Dewford, where I come and anchor away. Pico, we're setting sail, my darling. Time to sail on off to do for it. Aye aye, Capitan! Here we go. Nice and cutscene. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. Just take that in, folks. Just take that in. Wind in your f glow sling through your hair. Uh, AKA your hat. Just going, oh. The sea water just splashing on your face like that. Hmm. It's fantastic. Ahoy! We've struck land in Newford, lad. I suppose you'll be hiding ashore to deliver that letter to what's-his-name or whomever. If you ever feel lost in a drift, though, try calling in an island Pokemon gym. The leader, Brawly, sure knows everyone and everything that goes around in this town. Well, that's right. for gym. We can get our second badge here. We can get our second badge here. We can get our second badge. All right, what do you want? I like how you sit down now with the with the people when they're sitting down. She's like, oh, I'm just a pop a squat here. There's a lot to be said of for living in a small island in harmony with Pokemon in my family. All right, cool. I'm gonna sit down next to you, girl. When I married my husband. I moved here from the large port of Staleport. Life goes by slowly in this little island, but being surrounded by this beautiful sea, it's kind of a happiness too. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Respect nature. What do you want, buddy? This is a renowned fishing spot. Are you going to? You got the itch for fish? Yeah, I do. I hear ya, I hear ya, big dog. I hear ya. I like what you're saying. I'll give you one of my fishing rods. Boom shakalaka, just like that, we got ourselves an old rod. And as an added bonus, I'll even throw in a little fishing advice. First, when you face the water and then use the rod, focus your mind, get a bite, pull on that rod. Sometimes you can snag something immediately, but the bigger catch is you need to time the pulls on your rod to haul them in. Alright, so we got ourselves an old rod, which means we can actually surf here if we want. Sup, how you been training your Pokemon? If you want to make Pokemon strong, I'm super, super training now. We're not doing that. Um, we can if we want to. We can if we want to. We can fish. Uh, uh, but I think there's a cave or something over here in here that we can go to. So we can get to Pokemon in there. Uh, let's see what we get from our egg from there before we determine whether or not we want to use the old rock. I think the old rock will just get us at uh, level 5. Even if a Pokemon faints and can't battle, it can still use HM moves. Good to know. Hey girl, what are you doing all by yourself? As long as you have Pokemon by your side, you can overcome language barriers and meet many different kinds of people. Very true. Pokemon is that kind of game. The entry town is a cavern known as Granite Cave. I heard you can find rare stones in there. Yep, that's right, Granite Cave. So let's go in there and see if we can capture some Pokemon. Hey girl, what are you doing here, little girl? Different town, it's a tiny island community. So if someone gets trendy here, everyone picks it up right away. All right, cool. What's in here? Hey there, buddy. Let's sit down and talk to you. Feast your eyes on this. The silk scarf is cutting edge of fashion. Oh, I can see your eyes twinkling. I appreciate my dazzling style. What a delight you are. Here, please, I want you to have it. Thanks for the silk scarf. Neat and nifty. Silk scarf raises the power of normal moves. Alright, cool. Here, you big dog. Thank you. What you got? Wow, you brother to cross the sea to visit Dewford? Here, are you because of this about Brawly? He's so cool. Everyone idolizes him. Yeah, I'm here to kick his ass in a little bit, but uh, we will get on to that in a second. Oh, this is Route 106. Actually, this is a whole. This is a new route area as well. All right. I can actually catch lots of Pokemon here if I want to. What's over here? What's up, buddy? Nice and Pokeball. Nice and Pokeball. We got a protein. We got a protein. Okay. You want to battle? Which you for fishing in the sea or the stream? All right, we're battling. Apparently, we is a battling. We is a battling. We is a battling fisherman, Elliot, and we need to get that magic card out of the way. Oh, excuse me. Why do fishermen? Why do they all have freaking Magikarps? That's like all they have. 
When are we gonna get some fishmen that actually don't have freaking magic carps? Let's set up a D dance so we can just like. Ah, uh, oh. Because apparently magic carps are the fastest Pokemon in all the world because they outspeed every Pokemon that I have. So I need to apparently set up on this guy with Dragon Dance so that we can actually take out this magic carp. And let's uh, crunch it up now. Let's crunch it up now. That is not one shot. Wow. Actually surprised that that does not one shot. Pentacool, that's uh, poison and water, so let's go and switch actually to. Let's, yeah, it's going to bleed. Because I got that confusion, which is super effective. We got that confusion. Alrighty then, so let's go ahead and we'll hit a nice up confusion on this tentacle. Let's do some decent. Uh, oh, we get the confusion. We get confusion axe. Can we get confusion axe? Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Oh, no, we're gonna get straight. Dang it! But that literally does one HP. That literally does one HP. So we're gonna nice another confusion off. One more to take out this silly tentacle. You're gonna snap out of confusion. Here we go. 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 Come on, Butterfree. You can break through, can't you? No, you apparently cannot. Of course that would happen, right? I confuse him, but he doesn't hit him. Okay, I step out of confusion turn one. Alright, so it's sort of even. Sort of even. But. Yeah. Yeah. Meh. Meh. Alright. Well. Scrap. Alright, so let's go uh, over here and battle some more. Hello there. Alright, so let's battle you. People do if they take a break. What I got? Fishing rods in a washroom. I don't know what this guy's talking about, but apparently he's gonna have a magic card. Oh no, he's gonna have a tentacle. No magic card for you, huh? Go out and crog. We're gonna go out and Dundee, Medi. We're gonna go to nice crunch off. Got speed me. Woo! That that was a crit. Okay. That make us the sense. Well, that's not a two-hit KO. Uh, we can get another crunch off, and then we should be able to finish him off. A nice aqua jet. Oh, I forgot I have the orange berry. We're gonna prop, we're gonna prop my orange berry, get some more health back, and we're gonna crunch you off. See if we can get maybe that was bin damage. See if we can get max damage this turn. No. All right, we can aqua jet you to death. You should, that should be that should be range to kill for an aqua jet. That should be range. Yeah, it is. Bye. That was a crit. It was a crit. It was a crit. It was a crit. We're gonna get a nice level 12 Dundee up in here. So happy. So happy. Bouncing around. Alrighty. Let's see here. Where's Granite Cave at? There it is. Alright, so... Let's see. Are there any trainers besides that guy? Nope. Okay. Let's go forth and battle you. We can... So, technically, we can hatch three eggs in this episode if we wanted to. I was born in a village far from the sea, so I've always dreamed of coming to Helen. Where were you born then? Where were you born then? You were born in a village far from the sea. Chodo doesn't have very much surfing. No, it does. Yes, it does. It has a whole island area. Hmm, very interesting. Very interesting. That does not much. Oh, we get the defense drop. Go for a scratch. And that does not that much, so we're gonna get a nice nether, nether crunch out. We actually could have set up probably another D. We could have probably set up a D dance and uh, kill. Oh no, yeah, that doesn't matter. Yeah, he's got the silly truant, and uh, just in case we happen to speed tie or something, I'm gonna go for an aqua jet, which should finish him off. That rage. Yep, yep. Slack off is down. Ooh, nice and level 13. Nice and level 13. Bite. Oh, we know crunch. What's the point of learning bite? You silly, silly little, silly crocodile. Alright, so. Let us. Let's see here. Let's see. Oh, actually, we can start using KFC. Okay. Let's go on into uh, this granite cave. So, alright, we got granite cave. So, 
we can catch a Pokemon in here. And there it is. Granite Cave. What is it going to be that's going to be our token? Hoopsicles. It's an Abra, and it is going to teleport away. That is exactly what's going to happen. There's absolutely nothing I can do about it. So I'm just going to chuck a Great Ball at it. See if I can magically catch it. It doesn't look like we're going to get an encounter. We're going to get an encounter in Granite Cave. So that's kind of disappointing, but oh well. Oh! <laughs> Never mind, Abra! You got in that Pokeball and you are going to stay in there. <laughs> I thought for sure that we were not going to be able to get this encounter in Granite Cave because obviously Abra is just going to teleport away, but. Na 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 na! Threw that grape ball at the Abra, and he's like, "All right, dog, I, I hear you. I hear you trying to do an egg lock. I know you want to hatch eggs for your, for your fans, so they can see if we get uh, the eggs that they brought me." So, thanks, Abra, for getting that Pokeball. I heard you. I heard you. You heard me. You heard me, and he was like, "Yeah, I got you. I got you, big dog. Don't worry about it." All right, so Abra's been transferred to the box. So, oh, hello there. Oh, hello. Hey you, it gets awfully dark ahead. It's been tough to turn to explore. Well, for us hikers, helping out these meet in our motto. Here, I'll go on and pass this to you. Flash! Alright, cool. Flash, which is awesome, which means I get to use Flash. I love using Flash. I love teaching a Pokemon Flash because it's such a useful move in battle. It, it like, honestly is. Oh, look, it's Makuhito, the fat Pikachu. That's honestly when, I, when uh, this thing was revealed for Generation 3 back in the original day. It, it's, it's a fat Pikachu, look at it. It's yellow, it's got the red cheeks. It, it's a freaking fat Pikachu. Is it Why didn't I attack it? I don't know. Alright. It's Mira Head. The other day, Team Something in Red or Blue Shirts come go. Oh, okay. It's team Aqua and Magma were here. Very interesting. Very, very interesting indeed, indubitably. So apparently, I have to take on the gym first before I can go and check out, uh, so I can go give the letter to Stevie Owen. It's fine, I suppose. So let's go ahead and ember it up. So you know what? Let's, uh... Oh, my. Oh, it's got thick fat? A thick fat! You got thick fat! Hmm. You didn't use the freaking, uh... Sand attack. I would, uh... Oh, yeah, let's just go into Butterfree. Or is this just stab four times? You can get off a nice confusion, which is super effective. Uh, you're gonna fake out... Game, does, does game free, do you not know how fake out works? Did I not program the, the Pokemon? How do you use fake out? Because you just used fake out on the second and third turn. You don't know how fake out works, do you? Silly little nub scrub. Silly little nub scrub. Poison powder. No, thank you. Come back to me when you want to learn sleep powder. Nope, I don't want to learn stump before. Like I said, come back to me when you want to learn sleep powder. There you go. Yes rid of Harden. We don't need freaking Butterfree hardening You're already a Butterfree. You don't need to Harden. You, what are you going to Harden your soft body of squishiness? Not going to work. Not going to work. Alright. Okay, so I guess, uh, yeah, why the heck else not? Let's just fish. So let's just fish. Uh, where's the rock? Let's see. Let's see what level. Let's see. So this is 106. Yeah. Let's uh. Let's see what uh. See what, what level these get. Ha! Huh? Huh. Oh, apparently I reeled it too slow. Even though I had it a immediately after, but apparently, apparently not. Apparently I didn't. There we go. Let's see what level you at. What level are you at? A Magikarp? Big surprise. And you are going to be at level... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, 15 Magikarp! What the heck? Oh my goodness. Alright, uh... Night Slash you? I even know Staggle! My goodness! Level 15? Oh my gosh! This Magikarp's fat! This Magikarp's fat! 
and it still outspeeds me! It outs- this magic arm outspeeds a plus one Torchic! What the heck? What the heck is that nonsense? Let's get a nice ember off. Now I outspeed because I'm at plus freaking two. But my goodness. You're gonna tackle me. Alright. Get another speed boost up. Let's go forth and uh throw a Pokeball. I need to buy some Pokeballs, what I need to do. That's what I need to do, because I'm running low on these balls. I don't think there's a Pokemon for it, is there? Nope. There we go. Nice and token. Alright, so we got an Abra, and we got a level 15 Pokemon to hatch here. That's exciting. That's exciting. So yeah, knowing that I can catch Pokemon at level 15, which are actually higher than my Pokemon that I'm leveling up, that I've been leveling up, uh, that's pretty exciting. Yes, I do want to give a nickname to Magikarp. And that nickname is Token. Let's send you off onto the PC. And uh, let's go and use the Rod one more time in Dufert, I guess. Why the heck not? It's gonna be the episode of Hatching Eggs. Alright, we're in for Town. Which means that I can use the Fishing Rod one more time. And we can catch another Magikarp. Doesn't matter, because like I said, these are tokens. I had two zigzag guns at the beginning, because they're tokens. Just tokens for eggs. Just tokens. Nope, nope, nothing. Okay. Let's move over here, then. Now let's just register you, so it's easier to... I don't know why I didn't use it from the... Blah, 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 blah. Eh? Eh? Nothing, huh? Alright, over here. Come on, I wanna go, you know you wanna go, there we go. There we go, there we go. Come on, nice another level, nice another level 15. Oh, Tentacool! Oh, I didn't even know I can catch anything besides, besides Magikarps with the old rod. Let's see, what level are you at? Five. Well then. That's disappointing. That is disappointing. Poison sink. You're gonna get the poison, aren't you? Oh. Wow. Surprise, because poison sink is usually guaranteed poison. Oh my god, that almost killed, because that was a crit. Frida! Calm down, Frida. Frida. Hey. Alright, let's throw a Pokeball at you. Running low on Pokeballs. We are running low on Pokeballs. Go hold the down. No, 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 no. Stay in there. Stay. Oh my goodness, Tentacle. What are you doing? Do I need to put you to sleep? I'm going to put you to sleep because I only... Oh, there's the poison. There's the poison. Yeah, I'm going to go out into Butterfree and I'm putting you to sleep because I only have two Pokeballs left. I do have a Great Ball, so that's fine. Um, go out into Butterfree. You're level 5, you're in the red. I don't know how the heckles you didn't stay in that Pokeball, but... Apparently you're like, no, nah, dog, I don't want to... Oh, my... And you go for supersonic on the switch into my sleep pattern. Really? Really now? Really? Come on, Butterfree. Breakthrough. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Fall asleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Shh, 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 shh. Go to sleep. It's okay. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. It's okay. Alright, so let's Pokeball it up. Oh, yeah, look at that. I only got two Pokeballs left, and you, are definitely, you should definitely be captured now. You should definitely be captured now. You're asleep, you're at low health, you're only level 5, stay in there. There we are. Okie dokie, so we got three Pokemon we could, uh, we got three Pokemon we could, uh, to hatch today, so that's nice. That's pretty cool, like. Hello there, Tentacool, the jellyfish Pokemon. Did you know the tentacle absorbs sunlight and refracts it using the water inside its body to convert it into beam energy? This Pokemon shoots beams with a small round organ above its eyes. Do you have a nickname to tentacle? Yes. Token. He's my token tentacle. Bye. Alright, so let's go on into, uh, so I guess we're recording for about 20 minutes now. We have three eggs to hatch, so... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how long this takes. We shall see how long this takes. Alright, so, our first one up is Abra. Let's see here. So, you've got three... You've got two, so we are on this box. We've got our trusty, dusty dice of destiny. Let's go and roll you up and see which one. Uh, we got a one. So, first row. Roll you one more time. And we got another one. So, one, one. And, oops. 
Oh, 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 I forgot. Are you actually going here? I'm actually gonna, let's see, we'll put Torchic down, AFC, and uh, Ikakuman will get uh, swapped here. We can nice and uh, hatch you up. Remember, we do one egg at a time, so we don't get confused on what's what. Alright, so we're gonna go and hatch this egg, and we shall return in one second. Okay, we are back, so let's go ahead and see what our Pokemon hatching from this egg is. Quick, pause the video, comment down below what you think this egg is going to hatch into. Uh, what's it going to be? What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Because I don't know, and it is a... Another Eevee! Oh my goodness, people! You want to... I'm, I'm actually surprised that this was an Eevee, because this thing hatched super quickly. Unlike the other two Eevees, which took 15 hours. But apparently we have another Eevee. Um, I don't know what I'm going to name this thing. Um. Uh, let's see. Got Gerald. And. Mine. And this Eevee. Uh. You're a copycat. So I'm going to name you Copy with an I. Hope A. Alright, so we have another Eevee that gets to level up to level 10. Uh, Alright, so let's level you up to level 10 real quick like. Oh, <laughs> even though Freedom is poison still. So apparently people like sending me Eevees. Or, I mean, you know. Apparently Eevee was the common thing that was sent. You want some sand attack? Let's see, what moves do you know? You know, helping hand, growl, tackle, and tail whip. Okay, not a very useful Eevee. Yes, don't want to learn that. Not to know, and, and, and so thank you whoever sent this Eevee, I appreciate it. I do appreciate it, but unfortunately, like I said with the other Eevee, we already have an Eevee uh, Lucian in our party. So unfortunately, can I, let's just teach people all eyes, because uh, maybe we want a Sylvia. Yeah, maybe we want a Sylvia. Or a growl. Uh, so unfortunately, we, uh, we uh, will not be able to use this one for right now. And it wants to learn Swift. I guess we'll teach it Swift and Stab. Like what nature do you have, too? You are a dolly nature, so you're a physical attacker. Uh, this is great helping hand. We're not planning on doing any double battle in with this thing. Alright, so, Kope is going to uh, go back into the box here. He's going to go hang out with, uh, going to go hang out with the other Eevee of its buddy friend. We got Gerald and Kope. Alright, so our token Magikarp now. We're gonna get all nice in here. And we are all on box 5! So, oh, Dice of Destiny! Pick our Pokemon! 6, roll again! 4. So, grab our token. 1, 2, 3, and 4. I know this is backwards, so don't worry, we'll go back over here. Hopefully, we don't get a 3. We get a 2! One, two. All right. So another Pokemon egg. And let's see what you gonna be. Let's see what our level 15 is gonna be. See what our level 15 is. Hopefully some good. All right, so we shall return in one second.
Wow! This egg took like a good 10 minutes, over 10 minutes of me running around in here with Talonflame and Hatching Power 3 going off twice! And it took this long for this freaking egg to hatch, so... I don't know what the heck this egg is. I'm dying to find out what it is. Leave a pause the video if you want to pause and wait even longer to leave a comment about what you think this egg is going to be because I have no clue and I'm really excited because that, that took forever to hatch. It is... A why not? Okay. Why not? Why not take that long to hatch? Why not? Okay. We have a whoa buffet. Alright, um... Let us call you. Mm. Mm. Um. Cause why not? Cause Tom. Tom says so. Tom. Tom. It's Tom. Tom. All right, we have a level fifteen. Tom. Oh, okay. Don't you then? <laughs> that. Oh, it took a while. Uh, so uh, I guess there's probably someone. Someone sent me a why not, and uh, I did not know idea that why not eggs apparently take 1,500 years to hatch. It they take 1,500 years to hatch. It's kind of disappointing. Cause that took that took a really long time. I don't know how fast I'll be able to make it to speed up to where you can actually still see what's going on. I see me moving around. Cause when I speed it up too fast, it like starts glitching around. So. I don't really know how quickly that uh, that running around for me was is going to be for the video. But uh, why not? It's now level 15. And Tom learned counter. And mirror coat. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. What do you know? You know Slash? Splash. Slash. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of Splash because obviously Splash does absolutely nothing. There's absolutely no point in having it. Alright, so we're going to get rid of Splash. And uh, let's do safeguard. Now we're good. So Destiny Bond, yeah, okay, we'll teach you Destiny Bond. Actually, no. What? Why the heck would I teach you Destiny Bond? This is a freaking egg lock. If I taught you Destiny Bond, that means I'm thinking you're dying. Which, uh, oh, oh, you're evolving into a Wobbuffet! Wobbuffet! Alright. Wobbuffet is coming on through. <clears throat> so Tom is gonna be at his fully evolved form. Wobbuffet. And, um, that's what's gonna happen. That's what's going to happen. I don't believe... I think we're going to keep our party the way we have right now. But thank you, whoever sent this. Why not? I appreciate it. Tom has now been a part of our journey. And he will be in our box. When waiting in case we ever need him. He'll be waiting for the call if we ever need him. Alright, Wobbuffet. Let's go off and switch y'all for this. And uh, let's go and get our final egg. So this episode, which I thought was going to be short, is actually going to be longer than I thought just because of the why not egg that took forever. So we're back at box one for our final token of today. So let's go and roll the dice and see what we're going to get. We're going to get another one. All right. And roll the dice one more time, and we're going to get a six. All right. So there we go. Our final egg is in an ultra ball. That's kind of cool. Uh, let's see here. Alrighty. We're good. We are good. Let's go off and use our O power. Oh, we have it. Well, we we're able to get enough to level up to level 3 once more time, and uh, we shall return. And we are back. So let's go ahead and see who our third and final egg of this hatching is going to be. Again, if you want to post a con- you know what? Uh, you know, why don't you have paused the video before in the future tense and now let's see who our Pokemon is. It's going to be a Sviper! Well, that's interesting! That is quite interesting indeed. Sviper. Yes, let's give us see. What do I want to give Sviper a name to? Oh, I know, I'm gonna, your name's Sneaky. You're a Sneaky Snake. You're a Sneaky. Sneaky, Sneaky, Sneaky. You're a Sneaky Snake. Sneaky. Alright, so Sneaky Snake is going to grow to level 5 real quick like. One. A two. A three. A four. Oh, you learned Bite. Alright, and five. 
got Sneaky the Survivor is joining our team. Okay. Let's go on over here. We're gonna switch y'all back for our KFC. And the Kakumon gonna come on back in here. Alright, so let's go over with what we got. We got Kope, the EV, level 10. We got Tom, the Wobbuffet. And we have Sneaky, the Survivor. Alright, so that's what we got. That's who we have in our eggs. And I think they are going to actually stay on in the pod, the box over here. I think we're going to keep our team we got right now. Um, yep, that's pretty much how we're going to go. So let's go ahead and, uh, yep, yeah, yeah, let's, uh, I guess we gotta let Frida level up a little bit, so. We'll switch you out. We shall heal up our Pokemon, but we're gonna end off this episode right now, so I hope you guys enjoyed this long egg hatching episode. Um, if you did, remember to steer that like button down. Steer that like button for the three eggs we hatched this Pokemon. Show some support. Leave a comment down below, and of course, subscribe, and I guess we'll see you guys later.